Hi guys, Noob here, hope you're doing well. This is my tips guide to the Haunted Night event. The description for the event is as follows. Collect Ghostfire to join in the Haunted Night. During the event you may gain token Ghostfire by clearing any main stages. Collect certain amounts of them to claim... And I'm going to butcher the set's names all the way through here, I'm really, I'm sorry. Sashiki and Tengu sets. Gain a higher position in Ghostfire ranking to win Banshee Momiji set. Slide to view all sets. So, the first set you can see here is the Banshee Momiji set, which is very nice. Uh, it's very nice art style for this one here. Uh, this is the Tengu set, which uh, is also very, very nice. It's uh, got a wonderful look to it. And this is the Shishi. Is that, I'm gonna butcher this, I really am. It's a Shiki set, uh, which has a creepy little doll there in her hand, um, which I don't particularly know how to feel about. So, as it says, you may gain token ghost fire by clearing any main stages. So, all you have to do is go to any main stage. So, for instance, just pick this one at random here, uh, and complete the stage. Uh, I'm gonna hit done one. As you can see, I received XP as normal and gold as normal, but also two ghost fire. You can see how many ghost fire you've claimed so far, or gained so far. Uh, at the bottom there, you can see I have gained 80 ghost fire. If you click claim reward, it will then show you well, how to claim your rewards. As you can see, I've already claimed the first reward, which is for 50 ghost fire, which is a thousand gold. Uh, if you claim and collect, sorry, uh, 1,600 ghost fire, you will get the entire Zashiki set. Along the way, you can also claim star coins and gold and stamina. Uh, to get the Tengu set, you have to get 3,800 ghost fire. So once you get to here, say 1,600, you will have the entire Sashiki set, and then from there onwards, you are claiming only pieces of the Tengu set, so you don't get any gold or diamonds or star coins at that point. So let's talk about the Banshee set. Uh, after you have claimed the Sashiki and Tengu sets, there is still the Banshee Momoji set that is available to win. To do that, you have to get a high, pos high position in the Ghostfire rankings. If you hit the ranking button here, you can we can take a look at what that entails. So, gain a higher rank to win the Banshee set. A top 3000 position gives the set with normal posture. Top 500 will unlock this special background. If you have a look here, there are still rewards even if you don't get in the top 3000. If you get in the top 30,000, you can get two parts of the Banshee set. Top 15,000, you can get four parts. Top 8,000, you get five. So when you get to top 3,000, this is where you get the full set uh, with the standard posture. If you get in the top 15,000, you get the standard and alternative posture. If you get in the top 500, like it says, you get not only the standard and alternative postures for the Banshee set, but you also get the Maple Hunt background as well. Now, there is another way to gain Ghostfire, and I'm going to show you that now. This is the Haunted Nighttime Limited Draw. You can find that on your uh, drop down menu, just here, at the bottom, Time Limited. Uh, this draw will allow you to draw only items from that particular outfit set which is this one here you can see on the front here with the rather nice uh, demon demon man uh, it costs um, well the first draw will cost you 50 jewels after that it's a hundred jewels per draw but like I said not only do you get items from this particular costume set but you do get ghost fire as well which can which will count towards your overall ghost fire ranking so there are two ways to actually earn ghost fire.
But there we go guys, that was my Haunted Night Tips video. Hope you find it helpful, and good luck in the event. And thanks for watching guys. If you liked the video, don't forget to leave a like. If you don't already subscribe and you'd like to, hit the subscribe button. And I hope you have a great day.